Hey guys, welcome back to our off-grid homestead. Today is day two of working with my grandparents. They're here for a week or so helping us build our house. And today guys, we are working on the stairs. Okay, so this is the mid landing for the stairs that I go from the first floor to the second floor or loft. We're gonna have one, two, three steps and they're kind of pie shaped. And so we have to figure out how to we're going to divide it into three equal sections. I made a homemade protractor. Protractor. There you go. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to swing an arc from our corner here. And then what we need to do, because I don't know calculus, is. We're going to divide this arc into three sections. And I think when we did it on the ground, it was 12 and an eighth inches. Yeah. So I'm going to start with that 12 and one eighth on the real arc and another 12 and an eighth from there to there. And then the last section is 13 and a quarter. Why? Or did we do 12 and three eighths? Oh, because we did split the. We did. We started with that, huh? I think so. 12 and three eighths. <laughs> That would make a difference. It's trial and error. <laughs> if we knew trig, we wouldn't be doing this. <laughs> we get Sarah up here. Pretty close. Pretty close. Yep. Cool. So we're gonna work with that point and that point. So from our corner point, which is also our radius point, we're gonna draw a straight line. All those points. I'm gonna take it all the way to the wall because we're gonna use this for a template for what we build on top. This is the second set of stairs, I've pie shaped shit stairs I've ever built in my life. <laughs> if the math is correct, you have equal stairs, right? Yeah. And so you're gonna come from this step up to here, and then we're gonna step up to here, then we're gonna step up to here, and then we're gonna turn straight and go upstairs. Nice. If all the plan comes together, it'll work. <laughs> <laughs> so what we have to build is this one and then this one. Gotcha. And so we're going to build this one all the way around, and then this one will stack on top of it. Okay. So the next step would be to cut the piece of plywood or OSB to this shape here, and then build it. Um, we can build our riser up mm. to the what number did we just nine and a, i think nine eight nine and an eight nine and eight yeah that's yeah. right <laughs> Check this out guys. Hi Seth, hi Grandma. Hi. Hello. Look at that. The stairs are being made and it's really, really cool. Good job Grandpa, that was really awesome. It it's coming together. So yes. cool. Yes, I feel good about it. You do? Yep. Yeah, it's looking really, really awesome guys. But the stairs aren't quite done, so I'm gonna take the ladder upstairs to show you how the loft is looking. Ta-da guys. Floor looks great. Floor's mostly done up here. Um, we're gonna need to put some more floor joists up here and cover that up a bit and the stairs will come up here And we do have this big open area right here We're not sure if we're gonna put a wall there or like a partial wall or a railing I'm hoping we'll do a railing because I think that'd be really neat and make the house even funner than it already is And more fun. It'll just be cool to like look down and say hi to people on the first floor <laughs> So when grandpa nailed this in the tip of it flew off and so he's gonna have to glue it back in to fix it Nice. Okay, Sarah, what you gonna do? I'm gonna climb up the stairs before there are any stairs. 
Ready? Okay. I'm a real stairs anyway. One, two. I've got to measure twice. You can't hold on. No, you can't. Yeah. 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 No, you cheater. Yeah, cheater. Cheater. Hi there. Don't eat me. You silly boy. You bit my finger yesterday. You bit my finger. Hi, buddy, come here. We're on uh, shaky ground, you and me. <laughs> hey, mom and dad are back. <laughs> What'd you guys do? We went and got a lot more wood, a lot more plywood for building, finishing the dormer upstairs, and then also framing this side in, and then finish floor joists and room joist for finishing the um, floor upstairs. Nice. So we got that, and then, um, what else? Mainly that. And then also, um, we'll need to put do some blocking between the trusses, and so we got a lot of wood for that as well. Cool. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. guys, look at all that wood. Like, that's a bunch of wood. Yeah, some of them are 18 feet long. Wow. <laughs> Those are really long. Those are, I think, are going from the, like, the peak, like the raft uh -huh. that goes all the way down. Like that. These are called uh, risers, risers stringers. or stringers. no stringers, or horse, <laughs> or something. horse, uh, no stair horses. You guys haven't seen much of me today, guys. Look at it. The sun is wanting to go down behind the mountain. It's already evening, but we're still busting it out. We're still getting some work done. Right now, Sarah's in charge of measuring. These are short floor joists. Where'd pencil go? Oh. It's level because the Pencil. I don't know. Where did the pencil go? I don't know. You had it. I did? Is it in your pocket? Underneath a piece of wood? Underneath the saw, maybe? We lost our pencil. There it is. Yay. So the floor joists need to be 47 and an eight inches long. Right there. And then the other side too, because the square isn't long enough to measure it, or to connect the two points. I can show you a trick how to do that though. How? Okay, let's try it. Let's see if it'll work. Maybe I'm totally wrong. Draw a line from that side. Okay. <laughs> Okay, now flip it over. Oh, yeah. That, <laughs> that works too. There we go. That's Beautiful. kind of obvious, honestly. Now she's gonna measure from that end down this way. And we'll just have a little space here in the middle that's waist. Seven <sighs> and an eighth. Great. Oh, check out the stairs. <laughs> Coming along really good. Tux is learning how to climb them. Hey, we got our tub back in. And check out all this lumber we bought earlier, guys. Damn, man, we got some big ones. Two by 12 by 18 foot. It's gonna go from up here down to there. We got two by 12 by 16 foot, which is gonna go here. And then over to a, the top of a seven foot wall, that will be here. So it's coming along. Dad, how much does one of these cost? Huh, well, I can't remember. Oh. But the two okay, by twelve <laughs> by the two by twelve by eighteen was like forty ish dollars. <laughs> yeah, not cheap. No. <laughs> the other wood's cheap, like two dollars and fifty cents for like a, the, for a stud. Okay.
Check it out guys, the stairs are finished and they look pretty cool guys. So we got the three steps down here and then the landing kind of pie shaped steps here. And then that goes up to the loft here. Love loft. And then it's really cool because under the stairs we have a nice storage area which will be like a pantry, maybe like a storage area for things, I don't know, like sleeping bags, blankets, or like a dog house. That'd be cool too. Well guys, if you want to see more of what's going on in our homestead, there's a video right over here you can watch. Otherwise, I hope you guys have a great day and keep smiling and I'll see you over there in just a second.